Hey, new t-shirt design is out and I'll talk more about it at the end of the video, but for now, here's this. Hey guys, and welcome to my AP Nautilus video. Now what is a Nautilus? That shit right there. You see that shit? That shit's fucking cool, dude. Like, goddamn, that thing is awesome. Look at that. But what is the champion Nautilus? I'll tell you what he is. He is a fisherman. Do you know what fishing is? It's the art of catching fish. Pretty self-explanatory, to be honest. So while this is a guide on how to play AP Nautilus, it's also a guide on how to do something a little bit more important. This is a guide on how to become a fishing master. Now why would you want to learn how to fish? Well, it's simple. It's because fishing is a central life skill. It's the therapeutic, it's fun, and it provides you with food. It's really just an all-around good thing to know how to do. Also, because fishing is a really important part of playing League of Legends. Why? Because everyone's a fish in League of Legends. I know this because whenever I play ranked games, it's obvious that like 90% of the players are actually fish in real life. There's no fucking way that's people doing that shit. I have too much respect for the human race. <laughs> Now, right now, I'm gonna teach you how to go fishing in League of Legends. Cause you know how the saying goes, if you give a man a fish, you feed him for a day. But you teach a man to fish, and you're a dumbass. That man was prime market to sell your fish to, and now you've given him no reason to rely on your product anymore. Good luck with your lack of profits, generic proverb man. Now, recently, people have been saying things like, hey man, League of Legends is not a fun game anymore. League of Legends sucks these days. League of Legends is boring. League of Legends is not good. I'm done playing League of Legends. I'm gonna go switch to playing Shaq Fu for the Super Nintendo. Well, I'll tell you what the problem is. The problem is that you guys are still playing this game like it's League of Legends. When in reality, you should be playing this game like it's fishing. Wait, Darkman, how can one be a fisherman in League of Legends? Hey, why don't you shut the fuck up and I'll tell you. What are you, interrupting me now? I was gonna tell everyone anyway, but you, just, you had to interrupt me, didn't you? Is that what you wanted? Is this, this, have you gotten your attention? Are you happy now? Anyway, alright, now step one to being a fisherman, obviously pick Nautilus. Nautilus is the best fisherman in the game. This man is a fishing machine. His fishing skills are unparalleled and unperpendicular. Now some fish lack basic decency and will try to kill you underneath your own tower, and honestly I think that's just horrible. Like come on, if you want to kill me under my own tower then fine, just get over here. This is where you want to be, right? Let me help you out. Are you happy? Is this what you wanted? They're at it again, it's like the nerve of some people, you know? It's so rude. It's like coming in my own house and just taking a shit on the floor. Like come on, don't Kid, don't do that. Jin, I'm very sorry, but I'm gonna have to ask you to vacate the premises. We're renovating this area and we can't have any people here. So if you would, thank you. Thank you so much for that. It's so nice to see that some decent people still exist in the world. Thank you so much for doing that so quickly for me, man. Now, step two to becoming a master fisherman is to get some fisherman's bait. Now, bait is the most important component of the fishing equation. Without bait, you got nothing to draw in all the fishes, you know? You can set it in the open for days, but without bait, you ain't gonna catch anything. Now, luckily for us, the folks down at Riot Games have been so kind to provide us with some quality fisherman bait right in the store. Now you got a little bit of a variety to choose from, but the most common and practical bait to use is what we fishing experts call the pink ward. I know, it's probably an unfamiliar concept to most of you, but just hear me out, alright? It's only 75 gold, so it's nice and cheap, and it works like a charm. Now if you're a seasoned fisherman like me, then you know this is prime fish bait material. If you use this, you're gonna get all the fishes. Fucking salmon, tilapia, tuna. Sticks. You're gonna get all the fishes. Now you see right here I do something a little stupid. The Akali goes invisible, so I reacted by putting down a pink ward and see her, and I get the kill, but at what cost, you know? It's just, that's good bait that I wasted right there, so overall it's just not worth it. Just terrible fisherman technique right here. Is this the news? Cause I'm an anchor man. CNN. TCP. Look at these, look at these intense fisherman dodges. Only a fisherman can dodge like that. Oh please, as if a bubble blast could even attempt to stop me. Nice try, dickheads. Now step three to becoming a master fisherman is finding a good location. Now location is key to being a fishing master. It's important to find a place that many of the fishes are gonna swim through. This one, for example, down in the southern sector is my personal favorite. And now we set up our special fisherman's bait, thus creating our fisherman's post. And now we can employ our fisherman's tactics. All right, just Stay calm, I could have it any minute now. Just, just wait. Just with, oh! There he is. Oh. Oh, we got him! Oh, yes! Just reel it in! Reel it in! It's all your strength! Don't give up! Oh, he's a feisty one! He's angry! He's a slippery fish! Just keep pulling him in, though. Don't give up. Don't stop him or anything. Just keep going and just... Yes! We got him! Congratulations. You are now ready to become a fishing master. Now, 
Let's go catch some fish. Here I am back at the southern sector at my favorite spot and oh look foolish girl coming in here like she owns the place. This is my territory. Oh we got a real fish coming in this time. Oh wow just look at that specimen. It's got to be at least three pounds. What a catch. Alright wait for it. Wait for it. Oh foolish girl you fell for the oldest trick in the book I just wrote. There's a reason it's called a bait and tackle because there's the bait and there's a tackle. However, there is one fisherman fact that I haven't told you about. I have yet to tell you about the one being that fishermen hate the most. Behold, the fisherman's mortal enemy, the common bear. Guys, any master fisherman expert knows that bears are avid fish lovers, so it looks like this guy is after all the fish I just caught. But don't worry, while bears are very hungry creatures, they're also extremely stupid. So it's quite easy to pull a little trick on him and evade his pursuit like this. Check it out, his brain is so underdeveloped that he can't even handle my intellect. Um, actually, bears are the smartest creature in the world. They are just absolute geniuses. Um, you know, they say that 90% of a bear's body is its brain, so it's, it actually makes perfect sense that it killed me. That's, that's just nature, you know? And now, witness my final fisherman move. Inescapable ground pound no jutsu. Now another great spot is right down here in the southwestern sector. This is the home of the elusive catfish. He's known for his sharp claws and his minuscule intellect. Here he is now. Watch him fall for the oldest trick in the fisherman book. Now, um, I, I would help you with that, but then I would have to leave my fisherman's post, and I, I just can't do that, you know. So I, I'm, I'm very sorry. My deepest condolences. Sometimes the fish are so dumb that they'll straight up jump right at you so you can just catch it. Oh, look, here's one right now. Hi, friend, what's going on? That's what we like to call fly fishing. Oh, a collie fool. I put that bait right in the middle of the lane and it still worked. Don't you know that I always bring my fisherman's gunman with me on all my escapades? This one coming from downtown. So far downtown that it's actually uptown at this point. This one's coming straight from the home country. Salutations to all the folks. This one's coming straight from my mother's basement. Good times. Oh, you don't understand. I'm not trapped in here with you. You're trapped in here with me! Oh, oh dear, no. Don't do it. I have so much to live for. Please, don't do anything. Please don't, just, I just, I just want to live, and okay, is this, is, you want, is this what you want? Is this what you want? Fine. Take me to the promised land! Hey, Sona, your music is really nice, but I feel like you're a little bit out of tuna, if you know what I'm talking about. Hey, man, you seem a little bit under the weather. When you get better, you should let me know. Man, this person's really not having a good time. You could say he's really floundering about. Wow, that guy didn't even stand a chance. I guess you could say he's a piece of carp. Look at this guy. Yeah, I guess you could say this guy is, um, he, he's, what I'm, what I'm saying is this, he's... European sea bass. I swear to God, they just keep coming and it's just like, it's just, they keep falling for it. Oh, he's a feisty one. I'm gonna have to be careful around him. Unfortunately, though, I am the fishing master, so I just can't do much. Oh, Shecko, come on now. Do you really think your twisted tricks will work on me? You must be a clownfish because you're making me laugh. <laughs> oh, what a fool. Hold on, I'll just, I'll just kill him real quick. Let me just... I just <gasps> uh, I was the fish. I was the fish the whole time. All these years, I thought that I was the master fisherman. But really, I was just another fish being played by the enemy's traps. Do you realize what this means? It means that I'm one of them. I'm one of them! I am a fish! Yes! I am one of them! I'm a fish! Get away from her, she's my friend! Don't worry, I will protect you! For we are one and the same! I promise till the day I die, I will never let them get to you! And I will always be your f- Yeah, actually, never mind. I don't actually like her that much. She fucking smells weird, dude. I don't want to mess with that. Oh, look at this Malzahar. He thinks he's safe. Hey, man, come on, get over here. Just get in the bag, man. Get with the rest of the fishes in the- Oh, what? Come on! Alright, well, don't worry. I know how all these Malzahar fish work. They're all exactly the same. I don't even need bait for this one. All I need is my own beautiful self. Oh, hey, don't mind me. Just taking a nice little fisherman stroll down here. Not a hostile thought in my mind. Not at all. And oh, you fucked up. You fucked up. You fucked up. You fucked up. Hey, welcome to the end of the video. So, a uh, new t-shirt design is going for sale. It's called Mitochondria Man, and it's definitely not a reference to anything. And since you guys really loved the previous one, this one's actually gonna be permanent. However, only up until July 4th, use the promo code DARKJULYSALE to get 10% off on all products. Whoa, crazy, I know, yeah. Uh, yeah, that's all I gotta say. All right, goodbye, have a nice day.